Hello! Welcome back to another episode of Dragonlands and Fae. Today we have another new Heroes banner from Draconic Demise. And from the left to right, we have Ash, Tide, who you may or may not have noticed yet is drawn differently, Martyr, Cynthia, and Lucrieta. And back to Tide. So this is our very first art by Cat. They will be few and far between, but it is nice to see it. Now let's get into our first character. Up first, we have Draconic Queen Martyr. She's a green tome armored unit. Her weapon, Gifted Wind, 14 might, 2 range. Accelerate special trigger. At start of turn, if unit is within two spaces of a dragon or beast ally, grants all stats plus five and special cooldown charge plus one to unit and set allies within two spaces of the unit for one turn. All right. At start of combat, if unit HP is greater than 25%, and plus attack and res minus six on foe, and if unit trigger special, restores HP equal 30% of unit's maximum HP. So as you're going to sell with accelerated cooldown and special cooldown charge, and she pretty much, if the foe initiates combat, she'll be restoring HP with each attack. Basically gets a, and if foe is not a dragon or beast foe, or if you notice within three spaces of a dragon or beast ally, reduces damage from foe's attacks by 25% of unit's attack minus foe's attack. And also at start of combat, if unit's HP is greater than 25%, and foe's attack will reduce unit's HP to zero, unit survives with one HP instead. So she's very tanky, very hard to kill. Basically, you really ought to get a high res red unit to take her out. Luckily, she does not have any follow up negation, so you'd always nuke her and then come up and fall back. Alright. And let's move on to the voice lines for Martyr. I am Martyr Arias, Queen of Cephalia. Until I find my way back home, my magic is at your disposal. Queen is around here somewhere, yes? Good. I've been meaning to check in on him soon. Even back when I was young, I've always been able to rely on my royal guard, Sasha. Her strength is like none I've ever seen. Hey! How dare you attempt to remove my crown behind my back? You are lucky we are in your kingdom and not mine. I've been through a lot in my lifetime. I've traveled to a whole other world, and I've even led a war against Gritalia and won. Onward. Steady yourself. As you command. You've lost. Succumb to my power. The might of Zephalia. I'm not done with you yet. Cain, be the king I know you can be. Up next, we have heroic princess Cynthia. She is a Lance Cavalry unit. Her weapon, Electric Albert, 16 might and 1 range. Current speed plus 3, and at start of combat, if unit or foe's HP is greater than or equal to 75%. Grants all stats plus 5, and neutralizes effects that inflict special pool on charge minus X on unit during combat. And also, if unit speed is greater than foe's speed plus 10, unit attacks twice. So you got, a, you got a nice dual phase brave as long as she is way faster than her foe. As well as special as guard negation and all stats plus 5. And then at start of combat, if both unit and foe's HP is greater than 75%. Inflicts attack and speed and defense minus 4 on foe and reduces the percentage of foe's non special skills that reduce damage to X percent by 50%. And then, of course, if both of her and their ally, both her and her foe, are at high HP, pretty much makes it easier for her to kill them. And she also has a unique special that's only for her Heroic Flash, boosts damage by 40% of unit speed. And at start of turn, green speed plus 6, and no follow up to unit and adjacent allies for one turn. She is pretty good on her own, and with her special and the C skill she comes with, she can be a pretty decent support. I'd say she's a decent character, possible for a refine, but I think she's pretty good on her own. Alright, let's move on to her voice line, shall we? This lance was entrusted to me by my mother, who used to use it back in her arena days. Looks pretty cool, doesn't it? 
I am Cynthia Beatrice von Eldebar, Princess of Astelia, Hero of Thunder, Wielder of this Electric Halberd, and Guardian of all that is good! I heard Cain was kidnapped by a group of baddies called the Resistance. Do you have any clues on where they could be by chance? Ready for battle, Summoner? I'll take out any baddies you need me to, all in the name of justice! I know I may not look like much of a princess, but my mother helped me design this super heroic outfit when I was young. So, I don't think on changing anytime soon. On it! For justice! Baddies beware! A hero's duty! Hold still! Ba ba da ba! Cynthia's here! Beware my thunderous strike! But heroes never die. Up next, we have our four star, four star demote unit Lavender, Merc, Ash. They are a Red Dagger Flyer unit. They have an Inheritable Weapon, Blossom Dagger Plus, 12 might 2 range. If you is within two spaces of an ally, inflicts attack and defense minus 5 on foe during combat, and when unit deals damage to foe during combat, restores 4 HP to unit. Pretty much this is the, um, the Faye Valentine's weapons. Like Alphonse, his mom, Veronica. I figured this, it is surprising that as of recording this, they have not, they made vulture weapons, but not weapons for this point. Yeah. He also comes with his, his four star skill would be Death Rez Oath, and five star would be Speed Defense Catch. As you can tell, he's kind of a, uh, he's trying to be a little tanky, with kind of a higher defense, lowers foes, attack and defense, and heals. Yeah. Let's move on to the only character I voice in this. Ever since I was little, I was trained to wield a knife and taught how to fight. Not to brag, but I'd say I beat you in a fight. My mother was a bandit leader, and I never met my father. Hey, what do you mean screwed up? My child's been perfectly fine, jerk. I first met Hilda in some town nearby Gritalia. She needed extra hands and I needed extra coins, so it just kind of worked out. I wouldn't say I disliked living with my mother's bandit group, but I definitely prefer the resistance. Everyone here is nothing like the bandits or the resistance. Are you sure I'll even fit in with anybody? Target spotted. Point the way. I'm on it. You've shown me your weakness. Don't waste my time. Just pitiful. Why don't you cry about it? Mother, I should have never left. Up next, we have Mischievous Phalanx Tide. She is a Blue Dagger Infantry unit. As you can see, she is drawn by Cat. It's very nice. I hope Cat can draw a few other characters in the future. Yeah, she has Feline Dagger, 14 by 2 range. And this is going to be a mouthful. Is everyone ready? Grant speed plus 3. At start of turn, if you manage within 3 spaces of an ally or foe, whose attack, who, any stat is greater than unit's stat. Grants plus 6 to unit's corresponding stat for one turn. It's pretty much right there. She can get... If she is within any allies or foes with 53 attack, 43 speed, or 31 defense or res, she gets plus 6 to those stats. And then during combat, grants the following effects based on unit's bonuses to stats. If unit has bonus to attack, reduces the percentage of foes reduced damage by X% percent skills by 50% and deals damage equal 25% of total bonuses on unit during combat. Pretty much, she's most likely going to get 6 or 7 true damage. Depending on that. And if unit has bonus to speed, grant speed plus 7 and neutralizes effects that prevent unit's follow up attacks and effects that guarantee foe's follow up attacks during combat. And also, if unit speed greater than foe's speed, grant special pull on charge plus 1 and unit does plus 7 damage per unit's attack during combat. It's right there. If she has a speed bonus, she gets no follow up in Flashing Blade 4. If unit has bonus to defense, inflicts attack minus 7 on foe, and after combat, if unit attack, deals 7 damage to target and foes within 2 spaces of target. So you got kind of a just kind of savage blow. And then if unit has bonus to res, reduces damage from foe's first attack by 40%, and if unit deals damage to foe, restores 5 HP to unit, and after combat, restores 5 HP to unit and dies within 2 spaces of unit. She is a menace. I think she's. She would be a very big menace that would be around a long time. I am aware of this, 
but at the same time, this is just pro this is a really good way I could make it true to the original sourcing. Yeah, let's move on to Cat's wonderful voicing and Cat's wonderful art, as we do not see too much of that. Hey, are there any rafters around here? <laughs> You'll find out why I need it soon enough. Do you think I could steal what's left of Kane's tail? Hey, you have no proof I killed that chicken. The blood? That, that's always there. Could have been anyone else in this castle. Hey, where's Shad? If I don't see him in the next five seconds, this place will burn. Quick heads up. If the world starts ending, I'll be taking a nap in the rafters. Don't disturb me. Why do I have to listen to you? Feed me, and maybe I'll do it. Ugh, I'm stabbing you for this. <laughs> Death kitties! Kill my minions! <laughs> Jumping from the trees, gonna take your knees. God fucking damn it. And last but not least, we have our Grand Hero Battle Unit, Alluring Chaos Lucreta. She is a colorless tome infantry unit. And her weapon, inheritable weapon, Hibiter Sparrow. 12 might, 2 range. If a rally assist skill is used by unit or targets unit, inflicts attack and res minus 5 and guard on foes in cardinal directions of unit and through foes next actions. So this is pretty much... I've decided that if I can use play weapons, why not use my own inheritable weapons? Thus, I have made the weapons from my second summer banner into, um... I think the fun in the sun inheritable weapons. I've made that into a thing of the sparrow weapons. So if you ever see more of those in the poss in the possibly in the next one if I do that. She also comes with speed res ideal at five star and speed faint at four star. And she even has rally up speed. So if you ever want to inherit rally up speed around, she's got that. And let's move on to her voice lines, shall we? My, my, you sure are interested in me, aren't you? You just can't stop bothering me today. Veronica is a dear. However, the fact I have to babysit her 24-7 can be annoying at times. Francesca? Now why would you bring up that hussy around me? You of all people should know. We'd kill each other without a second thought. Do you need something? Did you really think I wouldn't catch you staring? <laughs> My age. Didn't your parents ever teach you it's rude to ask a woman her age? But since I like you, let's just say it's more than you may think. Don't be shy now. Yes. All for you. You've been bad. Night, night, dearie. A waste of a life. Your final mistake. You insolent beast! Thank you so much for watching, guys. I am so incredibly happy. It's been a year. I, did, I really did not expect to be able to do this for so long, so consistently. And um, I hope you guys look forward to our next video, which will be a celebration of the one year anniversary of the series. Make sure to stick around. I'll catch you all next time. Bye-bye.